Okay, it's your boy Nine and I Crash Bandicoot, and today we are jumping right into the rank four, which means that we are unlocking every single Thanksgiving topping, and the last one is the stuffing. So uh, finally, I am back. Uh, it's been probably at least a week since the last time that I recorded. I've been, you know, celebrating Christmas and stuff like that. So it feels good to be back with uh, the normal schedule. So because you know I am free, there's no school whatsoever. There's no excuse not to have a video uploaded every single day. So that's kind of what I'm trying to achieve right here. Even though I'll have to admit I've become lazy as hell. Like, extremely lazy these days, while I just sit around and I don't do a lot, and just watch series or whatever, and I can't really do what, what I'm supposed to do, like chess and whatever, like work out, or... I don't know, it just seems like I don't have a lot of energy these days. Just be, like, sitting around doing nothing at all. It's kinda how things are going for me, so... I don't know about you guys, but you know kind of enjoying the Christmas break as long as it's lasting because I know the next half year I'll get a lot of exams and stuff like that so it's not gonna be fun it's just nice to just relax and not do anything special but I am going to try to have a video up every single day alright there's the fake further that's a kind of a cool name <laughs> so I'm recording at 2 a.m. here which is pretty insane gotta be a little bit careful it's not really a good time to commentate and stuff like that, but, you know, I don't care. That's just the way it is right now. But, if someone wakes up, that would be pretty bad. Alright, so I gotta make sure it's not too laggy. Uh, it looks fine. I'm just trying to take a peek on the screen every now and then. But of course, the sound is always a little bit behind. But apart from that, it's doing okay. Nothing new with my videos or recordings of these HD games. So the blind has revealed that they are going to reveal the next Papalu game in the middle of January or something like that. And, uh, which means that it's probably going to come out like at least a month later. Which is in February or something like that. Like, we have a lot of time. I'm kind of thinking like what the hell should I upload? I don't even know. Maybe I'll have to stick to doing like chess videos for a little while. Might as well do that. A lot of people want me to do chess videos, but you know, never bother to do it. I don't know. Just haven't found myself doing that. Now that I've become so used to just uploading Papalui and it kinda of works well for me. We'll see what I'll do in the future though, while we wait for the next game area. Another game area. It's like my second best option is obviously a new game area, but to be honest, I'm getting tired of the game area and stuff. Like the best option would be like a platformer game like Papalui 4. That'd be that would be amazing, but it doesn't seem like they are going to release that anytime soon. And because of the flash thing. I really doubt that they will release it, which is a very big shame. That is a very big shame indeed. I really want that game to come out. I'm not very interested in the remakes and stuff like that. Even though I've really enjoyed this one though, I really have, but I kinda wanna get something different right now. Like it's always the same and there's no eventually, I have no commentary over it. You know, it's the same gameplay, like literally. <laughs> you do the same thing, you just take orders, and if you're taking pancake orders or whatever, it just, it is kind of the same thing. Alright, so let's get order number one out here. That was a little bit slow, but don't really care. At this point, what matters is to get the orders order out. I don't really lose any points either, that's the only thing that I care about. That's the points. I don't care anything about perfects or whatever. You know, I just want to move on. Even though I'm missing a perfect day, but I don't think I'm gonna be getting it. Alright. So it was pretty slow with that one. But whatever. Alright. There you go. There's the veggie dog finished. Alright. There we are. And um, let's 
get order number three out. There we are. All right. All right. <laughs> That's that. A little bit laggy once again. I'm sorry about it. Uh, it's just become so used to it because of I don't even know why. I just I guess it's hard to cope with it for the recorder. I don't know. That's why we want to see something different, something you can use to a computer with to record. But I don't have a gaming computer, which means that I'm not gonna buy games for the computer. So I gotta find a recorder for a PS4 as well when I'm gonna be doing PlayStation games in the future. I'm also sorry if I've been extremely off topic this video, but you know it's nice to have something to talk about. We're doing the same anyway. Like, it's kind of the same thing if you're like playing with stuff on a fence or something like that. I watched quite a few YouTubers who've done that, at least one in part particular, and he always he's, he like talks about like a lot of different stuff because technically you just do the same thing every time. If you play the game, you know you pop the balloons, and you know it's most of the time it is the same strategy and stuff. And that, it is the same thing here, which means that the commentary will remain very basic, like very much the same all the time. Like, a lot of times I've just struggled to have stuff to talk about, which which is the reason why I have more, like, uh, non-talking videos that I used to have before. Like, before I used to commentate on basically every single video that I did. At least, almost every single one that I did regarding Path of Blue games. I kinda wish I had started to commentate a lot later. I sound like a retard in my, <laughs> in my earlier videos, but hey, that's just how it is. Alright, so let's make two veggie dogs and finish this day. Okay. Uh, so one diet fizzle and then the large kettle corn. Alright. There we go. I'm not even gonna bother to boost them up because they finish so quickly. Which is obviously very nice. Okay. So let's do the fake further first. I believe I've got ketchup and then mustard, onion. And then sauerkraut at the top. I believe that's it. All right. <laughs> Man, it's so laggy. I really apologize for that. But still, the quality is way better than what I used to. Okay, I messed that one up. I don't know what I did wrong. Doesn't matter at all. All right. Let's finish with Queen's order. I don't really care if she likes it or not. Just want to finish. There you go. And that's order number seven out. And then yet another silver customer. There we are. Not the best day in the world, but you know, who cares? Veggie dogs, well that's interesting. It sounded like a tip uh, on what the first customer eats. Uh, like orders? I don't know. Because Big Paul it was the first customer and he ordered Kielbasa. Anyway, it doesn't really matter if you know what they order or not. You're not really gonna struggle with the waiting score anyway. <laughs> okay, so we're eight and a half minutes in and we're done with the video. Let's just see what special we got. We got the sweet heat, which means that we're gonna be getting 2.3 times tips. And it is a veggie dog, which is very nice. So the more, the less gaming time, the better. <laughs> At least in my opinion, you know, I'm getting a little bit tired of the game. Okay, actually not. This game is very good. But all the other ones, like especially like Papa's Pizza, I was pretty tired of that game in the end. Pretty bizarre because I really liked, liked it in the beginning. But you know, these games get repetitive and the only thing you're playing for basically is to unlock all the ingredients and all the top customers and all the specials. Once you've done that, there's pretty much no reason to continue, as I mentioned a lot of times before. But, that's going to be it for this video, so in the next video we're unlocking Christmas, which is pretty relevant now. Uh, I want to wish you all a Merry Christmas, I hope you had a wonderful Christmas. And uh, with that, I want to once again thank you all for watching, and uh, I'll see you around. Take care.